What's up? Welcome back to Vibe with V. We are now vibing. Today I'm gonna show you how to make three nice, refreshing desserts. We're gonna start off with the mojito fruit salad. A refreshing watermelon and berry fruit salad. Lightly sweetened lime glaze. The lime juice was also very good and went perfect with the minty taste. Next recipe is strawberry basil frozen yogurt. I really liked that this yogurt tastes just like ice cream when you leave it in the freezer for a while. Our third recipe is this delicious fruit and yogurt parfait. The cinnamon and clove really take this parfait up a notch. If you want to check it out, follow along. Mojito fruit salad. You want to get a watermelon that has this yellow spot right here. This indicates that the watermelon has been laying and it's been ripening up. So let's chop it up. We cut the watermelon in half, cut off the top and shave off the outer peel. You can remove any unripened dull spots. The more vibrant the red, the juicier it is. Then cut these in chunks. Next, you're gonna chunk up the strawberries now let's make the dressing. We are gonna mix the lime and sweetener. I like to use monk fruit sweetener. It has zero calories and zero carbs. You can also use stevia or regular sugar. Add the watermelons, strawberries, berries, raspberries, dressing, and mint. Mix it all together. Let this sit in the fridge for at least 15 minutes. This will allow the natural juices in the fruit to seep out, creating a luscious syrup. Try letting this sit overnight. The juiciest fruit salad you will ever have. I like that the taste was very refreshing when we let it chill. This recipe is alcohol free, but if you wanted to add some rum in this mixture, you will not regret it. Strawberry basil frozen yogurt. First, we're gonna add our yogurt to a blender. Maple syrup, frozen strawberries, basil, then lemon juice. Frozen strawberries give your yogurt the thick consistency. We'll need to go in and push the contents down a few times. If you have a blender tamper, this will make your life so much easier. You can enjoy it as is or pop it in the freezer for three to four hours for an ice cream texture. The basil strawberry combo makes this dessert come alive. The fruits made it kind of sweet, but then the basil toned it down a bit and made it just the perfect taste. Fruit and yogurt parfait. Lena had to come help because this one is her favorite. First, we're gonna slice up our strawberries and add them to a bowl with blueberries and raspberries. Then, we're gonna whisk up our yogurt with our maple syrup and vanilla extract. Go ahead and put that aside. In your third and final bowl, add your granola, sliced almonds, cinnamon, and cloves to a mix. We are slowly going to layer on our yogurt, then granola almond mix, and add the fruit on the top. Repeat until you fill the cup. And voila, you're ready to scarf these babies down because they are just that good. I really liked this one. The almond and granola made it a little crunchy as the fruits gave it more of a sweet flavor. Like the rest of the recipes, you can keep these in the fridge and they will taste amazing the next day. And there you have it, three easy recipes perfect for barbecues. If you are trying to watch your sugar intake, these are some nice, easy dishes to crave that sweet tooth. If you like these recipes, go ahead and give me a like or subscribe to my channel for more recipes like this one. Also, don't forget to hit that notification bell so you stay up to date. Thanks for vibing and I'll see you soon with another recipe.